Hello guys, so I'm just making this small video to show uh, the new Valve Link mobile application that has been recently released for, for the Trex, uh, the Valve Link mobile 6.1 and one of its features is that it allows now with uh, Trex for the loop actually to power uh, supplier DVC. Okay, so this one has been released uh, this week and I just would like to demonstrate to you uh, this new feature. So basically I have the Trex, which is connected to a DVC here. And uh, if you can see around, there is no additional power supply that, I, that is applied to this DVC. So the only thing that I have is uh, some pressure, okay? So uh, that I have applied with a compressor and, and I have connected uh, the Trex with the, the two pins uh, as usual. So now I'm gonna launch the Valve Link mobile application. Okay. So I'm going to select the heart capabilities. So now the first thing that is required to do uh, is to, to connect to uh, the device itself. Okay. So here I'm going to connect to the device. I need to power to give some power here. Okay. So provide yes. So I need to wait. Okay. So th this here, I need to select the first position where I want to put my valve and with which uh, current. So the one that I'm going to select is four milliamps. This is where I want the valve to start with. Okay. Okay. So now I click on the button connect. That's the first step that is required to do. So it's connected to the device. It recognizes the device, it gives the name, it applies some power supply, and everything goes fine. Okay, so that's the first step that needs to be done. So now it's done. So now if I want to perform some uh, any maintenance activities, for example, the stroke valve, okay, so I will have to move the, the valve out of service, okay, for a safety reason, apply, done and so here you see i have a couple of choice that that will appear in second 25 50 75 so here as you can see there is a small screw in the middle and this is this one that is going to move okay so if i'm clicking on the for example the 100 percent to open it completely okay here you have the 100 percent position if now i want to go back to the 50 percent 50% it release some pressure and bring back to 50% so that's one of the capability outside this one you can make a diagnostic you can make a total scan <clears throat> for that so it's reading the spec sheet and then it will start to pay to make a full signature of the valve okay so that takes approximately uh, two minutes uh, to go in back and you will see the curve that will start Yes, okay, and start, checking modes, reading parameters, checking supply, moving to press start, okay. And then, as we can see on the curve, it's starting slowly to make the hysteresis curves. This moves very slowly, so it's hard to see if you check very carefully the screw this is moving very slowly to perform a very detailed signature so up to the top and then it will come back to the beginning so i will just make one curve i will not wait for it to to go back As you can see now the screw is completely on the top, it has moved, okay. Okay, 
and then it's coming back here. Okay, so I'm gonna wait. You can speed up the video if you wish up to the end. Again, without power supply or external power supply, everything comes from the tracks. Okay, so directly provided by this connector uh, that is called Power the Loop. So when it will come back, it will make the average of the two um, of the two uh, of the two ways. So now the screw is completely on the bottom, as you can see. Again, okay. So reading some data. So the curve in red again is uh, was from zero milliamps to twenty milliamps, from the bottom to the top, and then the blue one is from the top to the bottom. So at the end again, so the Valvink mobile is making a kind of average of the two curves to define the, let's say the quality. That's the green that you can see uh, that has been displayed right now. So now it's writing, everything is completed and then it's done. So based on that, you can then export from the tracks the data directly to device manager by using another small component that is delivered with the tracks. So it's done. I will put that back in service, apply, Checking the device, 80%, done. It's go very fast, so very powerful. And then I can just go outside, exit by Vank Mobile. Yes, it will release the pressure and I will be back on the tracks. Thank you guys, cheers.